Sonagy Rehabilitation and Living Center is joining the growing number of nursing homes, closing their doors. Now, about 50 residents and 60 employees will have to find a new place to live and work. When families got the call, they were shocked. And I first thought maybe they were closing down for the flu, and she said, no, we're closing for good. Not an unfamiliar message in Maine. As we've been reporting for months, facilities like Sonagy have been closing and reducing services for the last seven years. Unique here in Bar Harbor, this facility has been sold to someone outside of health care. We asked them if they have asked other long-term care facilities or other, you know, health facilities. They said they brokered it out um, and nobody offered to buy it. Rinford has heard the nursing home will be the site of a new hotel. Not a surprise when you see where the facility sits. Right on the water and right next to other hotels and inns that in these parts are often full. There has been times when I've actually seen uh, the closest place was um, like uh, the Augusta area. Regardless of who bought the facility, it's closing. And all the residents will have to move out and employees will have to find work. You know, there's, there's people they hire to come and do, you know, landscaping and people they hire to come do plowing. I mean, there's all the local businesses, the pharmacies, the hospitals that are all going to be affected by this. Ginny Norwood's first job was at Sonagy when she was 18. She still does some work there and at other area nursing homes. She is concerned about the residents. I was sad and I was almost in tears. In Bar Harbor, Jackie Mundry, New Center, Maine. Uh, we, we've repeatedly reached out to North Country Associates, which owns the nursing home, and no one has returned any calls. Managers at Sonagy have also offered no comment.